Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another motion video. So, in today's video, we are going to be talking about my new team, uh, what actually kind of happened, um, and why I left FC as well. And on top of that, I'm also going to share a link with you guys um, that will help you guys out with some free resources here and there. So, I hope you guys are excited for this video. If you are, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel with Kirsan. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so, ladies and gentlemen, um, I made a new team actually. Uh, earlier today, I was just messing around uh, because I was teamless and I made this random team, I know, look at the name, it looks a little weird, but I just went ahead and made this, and I forgot to make a private, okay? I literally forgot to make a private. Um, the team was open this whole time, zero monster power, and I'm not sure if these are some of my subscribers, my viewers, or it's just random people. But if you see your name here, man, well, um, at least you stayed in the team with me. I'm gonna go ahead and start booting players out. Um, so, <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and just basically boot all these players out because this team is just like a chill place for me, okay? Um, so, let's go ahead and talk about uh, why I went ahead and left FC. So, an unexpected event occurred uh, while I was basically in the team with um, everyone else. Look at everybody just leaving. So, yeah, while I was uh, racing with them, you know, unexpected event came up and I went ahead and just left mid-race. So I did not get kicked, I went ahead and left myself, and as you guys can see right now, if we head over to team rankings, uh, 28 out of 30, and one of them was me of course, went ahead and left it, just because of that. Um, but, does this mean I will go back to FC anytime in the future? Who knows, but high chance I won't, um, because there was a reason why I left, and so... I'm not going to be joining FC unless maybe something changes my mind in the future, but there's like a high chance that I won't. Uh, but anyways, so now that we went ahead and removed everybody from the team... No! Wait, who just joined? What are you guys doing? I should just make a private. Alright, so yeah, this is just like a chill place for me, and... I don't know, I just wanted to create the team for fun, you know what I mean? It only cost a 10 million gold, and we could just get that 10 million just like that. And on top of that, we got like what? 80 more million <laughs> but anyways so i just wanted to make this video to let you guys know um why i left and what i'm going to be doing for the future what this means actually so i guess we could start a new chapter um i was thinking about joining team spirit going back to team spirit but there's no spot in there so i'm not going to be joining there until there maybe is a spot but for now what am i going to do right so i'm sure many of you guys are like oh i got a team for you well here's the thing there's a high chance that I actually join champs. This one right here. Um, I've never been in champs before, but I heard I got some pe cool people. Uh, so I'm gonna be most likely joining champs, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna be if I'm gonna be staying for race because look at these laps. So for example, you see the Raijin one. That one was actually worth it. I don't know why they didn't go for 200 there. Maybe something happens, but. That one was worth 200, honestly. I don't know why they didn't go for it. Uh, Free Tester, I guess that one was worth 200. I don't know. Jack Pack, at the time, it kind of was. But then, like, a month or two later, better monsters came out, honestly. The Orca Villa one was not worth it at all. I don't know why they went for 180. Um, this Nest Truck Marathon, no, that was just worth 10 laps, in my opinion. But the rest of them, these ones were actually worth these top ones. Especially Ural, of course. So, I will be joining champs most likely, guys, and I guess we could start a new chapter with champs, right? And the thing is, I'm going to be staying for wars, but I'll decide later on before the next race whether I want to stay in uh, champs or not, okay? So, I'll make that decision later on, but yeah, we'll see what happens, honestly. But yeah, um, FC, gone, you know what I mean? Not going to be in FC anymore. So yeah, that's that. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and get into the link. Uh, so there will be a link in the description down below that will reward you with 10 Mr. B cells and basically a bunch of other resources on top. And I'm not sure if it actually comes with gems or not, but you guys could check it out yourself. Um, if you haven't claimed it before in the past, well, go ahead and check out the link and get yourself some free cells and other resources. I would say why not, you know what I mean? But while this race is ending, um, I'm just going to go ahead and prepare for the next one. Looks like my Alfira is actually going to rank 2 right now. So, thanks to the rank of Sarola Dungeon, I was able to take it to rank 2. And I could maybe craft another monster in here that I haven't crafted yet. Nah, all these other ones are trash in my opinion. Maybe just for good for book rewards. 
other than that not so much but i do have to rank a bunch of monsters in here like for example i don't know about quace honestly i feel like maybe i'm a little too late with that but the monster is still usable this one yeah i'd say so vizil great monster this one's great so is this one this one's still level four by the way can you believe that but yeah i'm gonna have to actually rank those up it's just that i was busy with like team race and stuff like that um but anyways so there's actually some cells in for Friedel. uh if you guys i'm not sure when you're gonna be watching this but the video will be out before the five hour mark so head over in game and purchase yourself all these Friedel cells and prepare for race so i'm gonna be preparing for race and i'm, I'm not sure if i'm gonna be staying in chance for race i haven't decided yet but i'll decide later on but anyways, so besides all of that, I also want to cover up the Mr. Beast challenge right now that's going on, guys. So I wanted to make this video uh, a long time ago, but the Steam season came out and it packed a bunch. So I had to make videos on those. But finally, we have the Mr. Beast Equal Time Challenge. So the thing with this is I feel like it's kind of unfair for players that have already been playing the game and they have like literally every island full of monsters, full of habitats. I feel like it's unfair for those, you know, uh, the reason for that is because for you know, starter players, they actually have a huge advantage over us, a player like me. So you guys know, I do have some space here. Literally, look at this. This is a huge space right here. You can literally just fit this in here. You know what I mean? So they don't really give me any of those trash bags that I need to remove. And so I can't really participate in that Mr. Beast Equal Time Challenge. There's much more right there, much more space. And there's more space, for example, on this island, even though I haven't purchased it yet. And there are some other spots. But basically, I wasn't able to get any of those bags. Um, I only got one. And guess how I got that? Through the goals. Yeah, in case you didn't know, they're actually giving one away here. The trash token. And you can get it in the goals after completing all these challenges. So, I collected it. But all I got was literally just one. And I'm in like the 400k spot. But I think with that... I'm still gaining 25 cells here but for the first player they're getting 3000 and that i doubt it's an actual player i don't think it's a real player to be honest look at that this whole top 15 oh 20 30 up till top 49 it's i think ai's literally just maybe the game themselves you know trying to help out in this event but then the rest <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. They're all over the place. What? And look at me. I'm in like the 466k spot. <laughs> so on my baby account, I actually am in like the top 400, 500 maybe. I actually was able to get to like top 300 or so because I went ahead and used my gems, clearing every single one of the trash cans and basically got like up to 40 or 50 trash bags like a few days ago. And I was like, not in the top 100, that's for sure. But I was like somewhere in there, you know what I mean? In top hundreds. And I'm just saying like this 3000 cells will just be given away to like the first player. That's not really a real player or else they would have mentioned their name. It just says player and there's so many of them. So, I mean, it's kind of obvious that maybe it's the game themselves. Um, who knows? Maybe game developers doing it. I don't even know. But um, yeah, <laughs> it's pretty weird. So... Starter players does have a huge advantage over us. I'm not sure about you guys. Maybe you guys are able to participate in this, but I sadly can't. There's literally not a single trash bag anywhere around my island. So I can't really participate in it and get myself Mr. Beast cells. Um, <laughs> overall, this time challenge could have been a lot better. But sadly, just because of that, not so good. But anyways, guys, that's going to be pretty much it for today's Monster Gen video. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.